Hey Internet, my name is Abby and welcome back to Take On Mars. I did some experiments and I think I am now aware how to successfully build some kind of mini air base. So at first I like to disassemble a few things. No, wait, before I continue disassembling things, I like to... Okay, there I have crafted another airlock corridor, this is great. I can now throw it away because in the last episode I was a little bit confused how to create something like this and at first I need to construct a doorway and then I think in order to speed things up I will create another 3D printer. Let me just select this. Um, where is the thingy? I just need a 3D printer. It's haven't I just seen these parts? There it is, there it is. I need to construct another 3D printer. And now I like to take the time to say I like to disassemble a few parts because I don't want to create a huge base right now anymore because I have the slight feeling this will then take too much of time. So I think I will now create just a very, very, very small base at first and maybe later on we are able to extend this. Okay, I can bring this over to the next over here to... come on. Maybe for a future... no, 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 dang it, this was uh, the wrong part. To uh, for a future episode. Okay, come on. Give me that object and... No, no, I am installing it a little bit too high. This this building system isn't this is much better than the the first implementation of it, but it's still not really really easy or not really satisfying, I think. But okay, I can now bring this thing over there and now I like to disassemble this part. Very good. I can Okay throw it away. I can disassemble this part. Now I like to store it in here. What? No, you, you're not, not throwing it away. I want you to to install it. Okay, now let's bring it back. Back down there and install it there. Okay, apparently it's not working because of this. Ow, 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 ow. This object, okay, um, okay. Oh, dang! Arr. Come on! No, 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 install. And, and, and. Ah, finally, finally. Now I like to have the last part. Can I, can I reach out there? No, apparently not. Can jump a bit backwards. And okay, now I should be able to grab this object and I just like to turn it around very quickly and place it down there. Very good, very good. Okay, I now. Okay, there is the next 3D printer. Very good. I think I have. I just need to grab object. Uh, why? Why I'm not. Uh, okay, now. I think I did a few things wrong in the last episode because I. I tried the the wrong first approach. I found out after I did some testing. At first, you need to to start basically constructing the the base without an airlock, more or less. I hope I can grab this. Okay, now. Okay, and uh, where's now my miniature miniature base? It's. Over there, okay. I can now bring the thing over, and now the, the first thing is I have to install this part over here. Very good. Now I can continue inserting these corners to my base. It's not a corner, this is a different object. Okay, then I can these parts around. Okay, very good, very good. I like to install this over there. I can get rid of this object and store it somewhere over there. 
Okay, now I need um, three additional corners so I can now create new corners. Okay, over here. Wall corner. And I need another wall corner. There, another wall corner. And a third wall corner. I have to remember the right direction so that I'm not going through all the items until I find the right one, okay. And the last wall corner, very nice. Okay. Now. I can grab this object, very good. And I need to manipulate it a little bit and... Come on. Why aren't you... Okay, this, this rotation system is still more or less annoying, especially when you then bump into uh, another part and then suddenly the rotation changes once again. There, there's the, there's the right thing. Okay, very good. Now, what else do I need? Okay, I need now the sideways parts. I need... Oh, I'm no, no, I think I'm turning once again to the wrong direction, these parts. I need a wall curved. Okay, I can grab this object. Another wall curved. It would be much easier if you would be able to are at multiple requests at once. So let's say I like to have five of these wall curves so that I just need to say, okay, I like to have five of them and then the thing is automatically producing five of them and I don't have to, to give the order all the time again. Okay, I am now producing the next wall curve. Now I can somehow rotate this like this, very good. Now I can hopefully place it there, very nice. Okay. Very good, now I need to turn it around, maybe like this. And install it down here. Okay, now it's, it's getting messed up once again, but now, okay. Very good. Okay, now I can have my next wall curved. And, okay, now I need to bring it over here like this and assemble. Very nice, very nice. Okay, start in here and start con constructing a lot of these curved walls. Okay, can I get this through the door? This would be great and especially if I fit through this door as well. Okay, now I need, yeah, 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 this is good. Get it a little bit closer and assemble it there. Very good, very good. Okay, the next wall. <laughs> okay, um, I think you have now understood how this thing is working, so I will now continue constructing this and I will bring you back in once I can 
uh, provide some more exciting information about the base and how to construct it. So uh, yeah, um, enjoy it. I will continue building it, and then yeah, I will I will bring you. Wow, this was a, a nice move. And then I will bring you back in once I'm able to explain you a little bit more. Okay. Uh, yeah. To explain you a little bit more what you need to do next after the base is finished. So yeah, in this case, let me just continue building it and then we I will bring you back in. Okay, I'm back and I worked for quite a while. As you can see in the suit info, my oxygen level is only 54 minutes and I'm halfway through the oxygen and now I'm about to grab and to throw away my, my monitor. But as you can see right now, I managed to construct this shiny little cube. And well, this, this is really amazing now. I'm about to well, jump back into my tiny little space station. And not space station, but... Um, moon base, now I'm turning around, and here yeah, I'm almost finished with the construction process, now I can install my monitor, very nice, very nice, okay, now I have a monitor, and, well, this is, this is the, the station so far, the moon base so far, very nice, and here, yeah, so, now the next and most important thing is to construct now the airlock door, at first we need a normal door, a door. Let me create this. Okay, and in the meantime I can start working on the airlock door. I need this airlock corridor. I can now turn it around like hopefully this. Yeah, this is good. Now I need my tool and then I should be able to add this over here. Very good. Okay, my door seems to be finished. Yeah, indeed. I can now grab my door and I now need to... hope I can get this... Uh oh. Should I... I hope I can get the door in here. Um, ah, maybe like this. Now it should be... fit through. Yes, indeed, indeed, very good. Oh, no, 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 don't drop backwards. Jump a little bit forward. Okay, well done. Now we need to... Okay, I hope I can get the thing. I need now to... Here, like this. Assemble the store over here. And open the door. Okay, now I need the next part of my airlock corridor. Wait, I think I will just throw this uh, to the unused parts because there are a, s a few parts I haven't used and I like now to create a, a suit locker there. Airlock suit holder, this sounds good. I like to create something like this. And... Haven't I created this? I think I then need... A an airlock door frame, or how this thing is called, um, doorway airlock. Indeed, I need this thing. Very good. Okay, my suit holder should be finished by now. Okay, it's finished. Uh, is there um, I think this way is the right way. Okay, now I can install it over here. Very good. Now I do have my suit holder. Next thing I need is uh, the the door frame for my for my airlock door. Come on, finish this thing. And okay, here we go. I now need to position it properly. Okay, and how do I? No, no, no. This is the the wrong rotation. This is also the wrong rotation axis. How do I... Okay, then let's use the wall. Okay, assemble. Very good. And now I should be able to grab my airlock door. Very good, very good. And 
move it over there and then I should hopefully be able ooh, ooh. well not this way I need to turn this no and assemble okay oh then I need er uh, to make it a little bit easier to get in there not a ramp but a step I need to craft a step okay now I can open this door then I should be able to close this door. Now I have created more or less a proper airlock, very nice. And what about you and my step? Okay, my step is finished. Very nice, now I should be able to install the step down there. I hope so, okay, assemble. Very good. Okay, now I can put my thing away. And can I now? No, do I need another step so that I can get in there? Okay, I will construct just another step. I hope then I have enough steps in order to get into my container. But yeah, this is cool. This is definitely cool. I think I finished building the first base pretty close to my capsule. And it would be so amazing if I would be able to get up there into the capsule, but okay, apparently not. And my step is finished. Now I hope, I think, oh, I need my, my tool, my installation tool. I should, okay, assemble. Am I now able to get into this? Careful. Yes, indeed. Okay, I can get in here, then I can close this door. And open this door. Ow, 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 ow. Close door. Now I should filling. Filling O2. Yeah, I'm refueling my O2. And, um, well, before I do this, I like to switch on welcome to the habitat interaction system the tabs to the right switch between various functionalities of this panel including remote camera connection and a satellite map we hope our technologies help you survive on the surface of mars well i'm not sure on the surface of mars but i think it will okay what is this um room temperature 22.5 celsius okay very good um that's all. That's all. Okay. So I'm filling you too. Does this mean? Uh, no, no, no. No. Uh, where is my? Over here is my inventory. Can I? Indeed. Can I? Well done. Well done. And I'm still surviving. I'm still surviving. This is cool. Okay. I'm now inside my moon base. I can enjoy the view out. And here, I'm no longer wearing my suit. I can put this. Well, he looks a little bit sad. He's not really happy to be down here in this moon base. He's not really amazed by, by this. But here, we are now inside. Uh, he, he's, he's pretty emotionless. But yeah, we are now inside our moon base. And this is cool. This is cool. I finally managed to construct a moon base. This is cool. This is so cool. Okay, and with this, I think we are now at the end of this episode. I hope you liked this. And I hope you will be joining me in a future episode of Take on Mars. Until next time, my name is Abby. See you.